decided to sit out with Dexter. I'm trying to stay in the shade. More to protect my shiny head from viewers. <laughs> protect you from my shiny head. Dexter's, Dexter's sat in the shade with me as well. I'm having a coffee. Don't know what's going on in front. It's like the world. It's the Wetland and Wildlife Trust, Wildfowl Trust at the front. It's like Martin Mia. That's what I'm trying to say. I should turn the camera around. So here's Dexter cooling off. There's my view this morning, all these birds. We've got ducks, we've got geese, and even a heron sat in the middle of them all. I think what I'm trying to say is Wetland and Wildfowl Trust, WWT, as it's known. <sighs> Hello. Hi. We're very organised, aren't we? Well, I am. <laughs> Anthony is. I've been charging cameras and devices. Faffing. Faffing. <laughs> I've been um, mounting some artwork to post off as well. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm walking the dog. I prepped the boat to set off today. Um, I think the weather forecast is right today. It says there's going to be thunderstorms and initially it looked like it was going to be glorious sunshine. But looking above it looks like we're going to have some storms. Do you think? Because I've been up since 6am and it looked like this all day. I thought it would rain. No, it's dead nice sun because yeah. I opened the door catch when we're having uh, breakfast. Yeah. That was at 9, wasn't it? It's took a turn for the worse. <laughs> anyway, we've got our Nicholson guide. <coughs> she doesn't like us. We normally leave it on board. Yeah. Uh, we've got seven locks to get through today. Yeah, it's not a big journey, is it? To be fair, we're going to go to um, Upper Mill. Um, and then the, I think that's only a 48 hour mooring and the plan is to go to Diggle. However, we've had a notification to say that one of the locks out of order. Yeah, lock 25 is closed from today so, and there'll be an update today. Yeah, so we may have to contact CRT uh, and ask for permission to stay at Upper Mill until the lock's fixed. In fact, there's no other alternatives, no windows. No. Is it? So I'm just looking over the camera because we're more near Roach's lock just before lock 25, does that say, Anthony? <laughs> no, uh, lock. I can't see because I've opened the lock ready to go in. Uh, but we've loved it here. We've been here for our maximum two weeks, yeah. nearly. Um, and we're ready to set off. Met some really nice people. Yeah, really nice. It's been very quiet. Yeah. A few drunken people going past at night. But all really pleasant. Yeah, but they've been yeah. pleasant. Um, yeah, the cafe's just a walk away. Dexter could walk down by the river because, as you know, it's been very oh, hot. Yeah, it's been week. really nice, hasn't it? For yeah. to be able to paddle. Yeah. So we're off, we've got seven locks to do, and uh, we'll see how long it takes us. Well, Anthony's offered to do the first three locks, so I'm going to take the tiller and take Morningstar into this first lock, which is 15W by the Roaches Lock Pub. that we were given when we're in a lock because it's quite easy to drift forward and backwards <coughs> is to look at a point on the wall like a marker such as this and 
you know that you're keeping the boat steady. So Anthony's saying the next lock is full and there's quite a fierce bywash just to my left side, to port side, so I'm holding back from the bridge, otherwise the boat will just get pinned against that bank. These locks just seem to get narrower and narrower. I'm amazed that we got through unscathed actually, especially with me at the till. Fancy just giving me the signal to check if I'm okay to carry on filling the lock. I'm really enjoying being at the tiller and doing the locks. Anthony's feigning some fake illness now, saying he's got a sore knee. <laughs> He'll kill me when he watches this. He has got a sore knee. So he's done these first three locks. I'll do the next couple and we'll see who can do the last three as well. Gorgeous day again, how lucky are we? You can nearly see how quickly the boat raises once all the panels are open.
is our Dexter with his cool jacket on. <laughs> Come on. That was not too high, is it? I don't think so. I can't keep an eye on that on this truck. Oh, it looks fine. I can't see this side. What? Oh. The views around this corner were just breathtaking. I couldn't believe the countryside and the open views ahead. We really do love the Huddersfield Canal so far. There or somebody navigate it, operating it. These views are just over the wall, right next to the canal. Stunning, isn't it? Dexter, come away. Every time you close these style of gates, you've got to climb over or under. I mean, I've got lanky legs and I really struggle. I don't know anybody else does it, to be honest. Now I know people get nervous when I walk over these gates but I do always make sure they're dry and I always make sure the water's at least half full and we did have family in the circus apparently.
we looked all these guard houses and went on the canal here and it felt more like cruising through somebody's back garden. Bees are really narrow. I can see me having to get the blacking out later to touch up the rubbing strip. What do we think of today's journey then, Anthony? Yeah, really nice. It's like forecast with like heavy rain, wasn't it? But yeah. Absolutely beautiful. And thunderstorms, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm quite impressed with um, the scenery as well so far. Yeah. The lots have been a bit hard. Um, they've got anti vandals on as well, so. Not all of them, just the odd one, isn't it? No, all they, of them have anti vandal right. devices on. Well, some um, aren't working. <coughs> and so the actual them. paddles are really stiff. But the gates with dead lights. But we're absolutely loving it on the Huddersfield Canal. It's stunning. Yeah. And I can't believe how quiet it is. I think it's like a really under-navigated canal, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and it's a real shame because the scenery like, has been stunning so far. I um, even like the washing hanging out in the garden. Yeah. Reminds me of being a kid. How's your knee? I think there's fluid on it. I've, don't, I've not injured it, so I don't know what's caused it, but... Is it a war injury? Yeah. <laughs> it's probably from his youth days of being a yobbo. I don't think so. <laughs> probably when I did gymnastics when I was younger. Oh, yeah. I'm a pole dancing days. Yeah, when you were drunk <laughs> and all that. drunk in it. Grand Canary. Probably a tiny bump. Concentration on anything today. You can feel it. 
感じの。よくよく。<笑>ちょっと行ってみましょう。ここにはキングフィッシュのパブがあります。これは、ここにはキングフィッシュのパブがあります。Under the main road here, just by Upper Mill, and it was nice to see these nest boxes on the left. And some of the birds had actually nested on top of the boxes. It was nice and cool down here too. I tried to moor here while Anthony closed the gate, but it was really shallow, and we decided to move forward with the boat in front. We're filled with water, and we stayed just one night here before moving further on. Well, that's it for this week. Thanks for watching, and have a great week. <laughs>